talk to people who know much more about the Vata than I do, and they say that it went in and out of fashion. Um, quite quickly in and out of fashion. So it would have been a different amount of fashion in different places at different times. Um, singers were always expected to uh, have a vibrato, particularly uh, if they were doing a crescendo, and that's one of the things that the violin could imitate. They, they call it a mezzo di voce, so you go... You, you sort of... As you increase the volume, because the other thing is that the vibrato is a slight amplifier. If you would measure it with something electronic, you'd find that once you start the vibrato, it slightly makes it slightly louder. Um, but it also sweetens it up. You know, if you... I don't know. It's hard. Somehow facilitates a beautiful crescendo. And that's almost all the violin pieces talk about vibrato in that way. Um, almost all the violin pieces talk about vibrato saying you shouldn't use it on short notes. The only one who's the exception to that is Gimignani, and he seems to be uh, advocating almost a modern style, and nobody quite believes that, but Gimignani was rather extreme anyway. But, but generally, you could say that it would be on long notes. You, you, vibrato was a kind of much more self-conscious ornament. But like in the beginning of this, I'm not, I'm not thinking of keeping my hands still, you know. I, I, some of my young colleagues, they get very into not having vibrato, and what happens is they get a lot of hand tension. I think it's actually really, um, it's not a very good idea to, think, idea to think of keeping your hand completely still. It actually makes you very tense. And so, you know, if there's a certain amount of just sort of moving around, I don't, I don't get into it. I don't worry about it very much. You know, for sure, in the 17th century, they were thinking, I must have been right up. You know, <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't part of They didn't have those kind of rules. <laughs> Because it, for me, it destroys the rhythm. And what I see is that in people like Leclerc, 
They actually write in when they want you to do these are all written as graces and then the So I I honestly don't think that they would ever do that um whatever. Um which always sounds to me like somebody suddenly sh- shot the guy in the leg. He was dancing along and suddenly they shot him. Okay. So oh, it really disturbs me.